What's up? So, I've been married for like 11 years now, I think. I don't know. I'm a horrible husband. Uh, I do have a nine-year-old granddaughter, though. She's pretty cool. Uh, and I realized that when you're 26 and you become a granddad, yeah, what? Yes, I do have a nine-year-old granddaughter. <laughs> when you're 26 and you become a, a grandpa, it's uh, pretty fun. Because you get to treat the kid basically like how your grandparents treated you and not how your parents treated you. And then you just get to give them back to the kid that was like, hey, I don't know how to pull out like you do. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not by with that. So I clearly didn't have an 18 year old son when I was 26. Uh, but I did marry an older woman. And yes, it does graduate to guilt porn when you turn 35. <laughs> uh, I do like older women, that's why I married my wife, she's amazing. Uh, it's weird though, because clearly with the beard now, I've only been growing it for about a year, and uh, she doesn't like it. And she likes to send me articles to reference how she doesn't like it. Uh, there's this new article out, or there, not new wish, but uh, it said uh, nowadays, Dog's fur is cleaner than men's beards. And I was like, that's not possible. I clean mine. Uh, I actually use a really good product. It's an all-natural, uh, hipster-friendly product for you college kids. Uh, it's called K-Bar Soap Company, and they have a really good uh, scent called Whiskey and Bad Decisions. My wife smelled it for the first time, and she's like, oh, what's that? And I was like, well, it's pretty much marriage. <laughs> She didn't like it. <laughs> I did uh, recently, though, change up my scent, and it is uh, called Napalm in the AM. <laughs> yes, it does smell like burnt Vietnamese kids. <laughs> <laughs> Some people might be <laughs> uh, It is pretty good, though. Uh, I do have to let you know, though, like, I, I make fun of my wife a little bit, but I don't have to do shit. Like, all the guys that like have honey-do lists, sucks to be you, you should marry a different woman. <laughs> I don't do anything at home. I go, to, I go to work, I come home, turn on the Xbox, that's it. I had a VA appointment one day, and uh, so I didn't have to go to work. I come home, our youngest daughter's in the house, she was in the kitchen, and I was hungry, so I was gonna make myself something to eat, and I was like, oh shit, there's no clean dishes. I looked her straight in the face and said, hey, don't tell your mom I'm about to uh, wash a bowl and spoon so I can have some cereal. Literally, that evening when my wife gets home, she's like, hey, heard you know how to do dishes. <laughs> <laughs> Never tell my daughter anything again. <laughs> All right, guys, I've been Judging Front. Thank you. Woo! Thank you.